Welcome back to the Hank Strange Situation, Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded. Make sure to check out HankStrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts. Okay, so um, Aries is in Florida. Like he said, he's in Orlando. Um, how did you link up with him? I don't know if he's frozen again, Brickell. So how did you link up with Aries on this project? So we actually... It was really funny because Joe was actually like, hey, I found this gig. Um, let's go to this place. And, you know, we thought it was like some kind of like paid gig or something. But it was actually Guncraft was – or not Guncraft, sorry. Um, forgetting the name. The T-shirt company. Why am I spacing it? Uh, not Gun. Nine Line. Um, uh, what is it? Style. Grunch. Gr oh, okay. Grunt style. Grunt, Grunt style. Yeah, yeah were, Grunt style. They were hosting like a meeting or whatever, and they were asking a bunch of people to come – and they were talking about how they could make like the Jacksonville floor, like the Jacksonville Stadium, like the games, like the football games, how they can make them better because they were buying like a section of it. And they were just kind of pitching people for different ideas and stuff. And so we showed up. They gave us pizza and booze. It was like a fun party and everything. And then Aries was there, too. I think he actually drove. It was in Jacksonville. He drove up to Jacksonville from Orlando, right? Yeah. Yeah. And we were just kind of talking and he introduced himself we were i was like oh what do you do and he told me everything he does and stuff and we thought it was pretty cool so we exchanged information and then later down the road we kind of just met up and we just for the fun of it kind of like recorded a little song it was a Nicki minaj song and okay. then we were like you know, let's do it did this we were did like, this actually like come out song. this Nicki super minaj. bass no it was oh. super bass it was oh. the, her actual lyrics we were just like testing out to see if i could actually do it and mm -hmm. not sound like complete crap, you know? Okay. So for the old guys like me and Walter, you guys are going to have to explain. Someone, ironically enough, someone was explaining to me what bass means. So, because like listen, I'm, I'm old. I'm an old dude. What do you mean so, bass? Like cause, bass well, they, music? You, you, or... No, you both just said it was super bass, right? Is that what you, is that what you guys said? Yeah. So. so Nicki Minaj's song is that, super that was bass. The song. Oh, super yeah, bass. Yeah, I think she's talking about her oh. super butt, like you're just a big oh. butt. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have to go check out that. So is there a video for this song? That's mostly what I like. You know, I like yeah. To... There's a music yeah, video yeah. and yeah. she's in it. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm gonna have Heard to. Heard her super bass. Yeah, I didn't see. Okay, uh, so super bass. That's the booty. That's the booty. That's the booty. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought that was slang. Obviously, it is slang for the booty. I didn't know this. Oh, I didn't know it. Yeah. AKA bass, back porch. Super bass. That's a back porch. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's yeah. a lot of slang for booty. I mean, let's be honest. There's a lot of slangs. Okay, cool. So you guys yeah. did that, but you it, so that never got released, right? You never, you didn't put that out, whatever you did. There. No, we were just, we were just having fun, like messing around with, um, seeing what he could do with my voice and stuff. Mm -hmm. Cause that, I mean, we just, I was singing her it, it, lyrics. It was more, her song. more than her comfortable on the microphone. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So you, are you trying to tell me that, uh, she was shy or something like that to get on the microphone? Well, it was her first know, time it? recording music, so oh, okay. a lot of people, they've never done it before, and it's a lot different than singing in your car or anything, so mm -hmm. it's really her comfortable, yeah. you, you play something that's familiar, that she knows what it should sound like, and yeah. you, you know, just so she gets that that nervousness that you have when you step yeah. up to a recording studio for the first time. Yeah, I mean, because I think everyone out there thinks they're a superstar when they're in the shower, you know? Like... In the shower, and when you're singing to yourself, you're like, man, I should make an album. I'm good. But then you get in front exactly. of that microphone, it's like a whole different deal. Yeah, you start exactly. hearing yourself, and you start, yeah. you know, it's all honed in on you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That gave me an idea for what I could do with her voice and, and be, you know, the best advice as far as, like, top records to make from there. Oh, okay. All right. Very cool. Very cool. And by the way, Walter, I know Walter was trying to show off uh, his toy gun. Walter, don't try, don't try, you, you didn't come on the show yesterday. You're coming on. So I don't know if you know this, Aries, but we can't actually show guns on the show. So we have toy guns, but Walter likes uh, to show okay. something real sneaky. And then YouTube is actually watching us and they believe it's a real gun. So that's what I'm trying to, I'm just trying to clarify <laughs> that because that's how Walter gets us kicked off all the time. So we yeah, can't man, actually... I say, if that's a real black. gun, that's pretty... I want Here's my toy gun. Oh, yeah, my favorite. That were orange. 
all the time. Yeah, what what was that? You what were you saying? You froze there. Oh uh, no, I was saying I, I thought it was real at first. The orange gun. Yeah. No, no, no. Oh, we, can you hear? Okay, no. Yeah. Yeah, we usually, so we usually, you know, before YouTube made these stupid rules, we used to show guns all the time, but now because of the stupid rules, we can't do it. So everything has to be fake, you know, like this, like fake toy gun stuff, you know, <laughs> nothing actually going. But we have to be really clear because YouTube will still delete everything. Um, are you, you're into guns, right, Aries? Yes, I am. Oh, okay. Um, I think that Joe was telling me you're in the military. Were you, were you, was that true? Yeah, I was, I was in, uh, I actually was deployed for a year to Iraq, uh, okay. Camp Taji. Um, that was my home base. I was there for, uh, what was it, August 2008. Yeah. So, okay. But, um, I was transportation, so I was all over the place between, you know, all the way north of Missoula, mm -hmm. down distance. Okay. And back then, I was the littlest guy, too, and I had to... Two four nine. Ah. Oh. Yeah. So we always had to. Yeah, we had to carry a thousand rounds at all time. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> thousand rounds. Uh, you ever tried to fit? Go ahead. A bulletproof place in a two four nine. Um. Yeah, that's how you get a heart attack. <laughs> 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 if you're not really fit, <laughs> that's how you die. <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to lug. How much? What would a thousand rounds of of that like? Let me see. What is that? Uh, well, what is that's that? Belted. That's belted thousand rounds. So it's even heavier. Yeah. Oh. Because oh. you yeah, have the link. Had... Yeah, the two forty nine. That's a fifty, was, right? Uh, no, that's two that's two twenty three. Oh, it's two five five six. Oh, it's five five six. Okay. Okay. It's automatic. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um. What was I? So what was I thinking? Oh, I was thinking of the saw, but that what's the what's the name for the saw? That is a two forty nine. Oh, that. Oh, okay. All right. The two forty. The two forty is a three hundred eight. Oh, okay. Oh, there isn't a fifty version of that then. Well, it's a M two. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can't you can't lug that around. No, it's like no, no. no. Okay. Well, you can, right, but there. not. not. Yeah. Not on patrol. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> not unless you're Rambo. Yeah. Not unless you're Rambo. I was going to say, Aries has a song that, like, before he met me, he made or whatever. And uh, you, you know your song, Don't Tread on Me? That's a good song. Um, yeah. Yeah. I think, uh, some, I think someone perfect. sent me I a link her, to that. Like, it was a perfect checklist. Mm -hmm. Okay. So in your music, do you talk a lot about guns? Uh, I, I talk about... Uh, you know, just our rights in general. Okay. Uh, but that's one that I... I, I rights. Uh, among other things. And, uh, you know, a lot of my perspective is from... So I try to talk about things that are in line with what we deal with and what we believe in. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Um, that's int I'm, I'm just trying to... Because I'm, get, I'm only getting some of it because you're breaking up a little bit. Um you, you said you try to talk about things that are in line with what you believe in? Yeah, as far as, uh, you know, just standing up for the rights that we are given. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay. So you, Which like, how would you... How, our I'm sorry, go ahead. Oh. Nah, I think I'll cut it now. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to say, I can't really hear what he's saying. Yeah, I'm trying to, uh, the, your, your signal's coming in really bad. So I'm not sure. You might have a bunch of things on the Wi-Fi or something like that. Well, I'm going to switch my Wi-Fi network. Yeah, no worries. No worries. Right, it, might, it might cut me off momentarily. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. We'll try to get this, we'll try to get this worked out here. Um, it's Orlando. Orlando has terrible service. <laughs> yeah, I blame it. I blame it on, is COVID-19 is COVID affecting Orlando? COVID nineteen. Yeah. Probably. <laughs> the five G networks. <laughs> That's the China. China. Yeah, there you go. That's that looks I don't know, that looks better. <laughs> That's normal now. Yeah. You know, it, yeah. It's probably cause, you know, my, my son's playing on the online gaming, like video oh, online oh, shit. Oh you know? no, no, no. Oh man. Uh -oh. Yeah. You gotta I never know That's which like... network he's on. Oh, okay. What were you gonna say, Brakel? It's like it's like when Lola goes on the internet and you have to yell at her, "Get off the internet, yes. Lola!" Yes, I know. <laughs> I know. 
And my kids right now, especially with all everyone's home, so I have two boys in their home, and those games, man, oh my gosh. They take up so much, yeah. yeah. I yeah. wish I would have installed something. Like one of my friends has this thing installed on his router so that he could just like push a thing and it cuts off their internet. I should have done that. <laughs> well, so. this is better than like the 90s. Like when I was growing up, if somebody called, it would kick you off the internet, like on your dial-up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> Of course, of course, it's better. Okay, so you were trying, you were trying to talk about what you believe in. And I'm trying to get that out there for the for the folks that are there. So, like, you know, w- how would you categorize yourself politically? Like, you know, what are the things you believe in and you talk about? Um, here? To me, it's just having having that right as far as you know what's in our constitution. Whether you believe in this or that, mm-hmm. it's allowing you to have your perspective and having your beliefs, but mm-hmm. not to. You know what I'm saying? Not trying to dictate or manipulate someone else to, to, to share your viewpoint, but to be able to share yours. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, I, if someone doesn't, you know, like guns, hey, nobody's making you own a gun. Mm-hmm. But it shouldn't infringe on mine and it shouldn't infringe on someone else. You feel me? Amen. <laughs> Absolutely. You're talking. Yeah. You know, I just want to esta- I want to like I want to establish where you're at, because I think the audience out there, they know where I'm at. They know where Bukel's at. Obviously, we all know where Walter's at. Um, he's crazy (laughs) you know and and you're there with us too at least in that like i don't think we all have to believe exactly the same things but yeah that constitution is there so that we could all get along and realize like hey you know this is this is what we all have right here we have to work with it and if you don't like if you don't want to do this you don't have to yeah i mean that's exactly it's very it's very easy Mm -hmm. i don't see you know why people have such a hard problem accepting others point of views or perspectives you know they're free it doesn't really bother me with outside of my house nobody's coming in my bu- in my house dictating my life it doesn't change me so mm-hmm. i don't understand why people have such a hard time especially in today's day and age i don't know if that has to deal with like social media because people feel like they can be in your face you know 24 7 if they're on your phone but that's that's not going to change somebody it's not going to change you you know mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah i think that's true Okay, so um, what's what's up, Walt? No, I'm just listening. Um, okay, all right, all right. So I know I listen to the music because you you guys sent it to me, so I've been listening to it. Walt, well, I listened I... the whole thing when I got home. Okay, awesome. Again. Oh, nice. You Again. listen to it. Yeah. Okay. So I mean, we want to get we want to get some conversation going here, and Bacal, just tell the folks out there because that this is out. People could buy it right now, right? Or is it coming out? What, what, yeah. What's so it's on pre-order right now. Okay. Um, so you can go to americangunchick.com and pre-order it, and then the release will be April 30th. So, and if you order it right now, it's actually cheaper to pre-order it than to buy it when it comes out. Okay, okay, so it's cheaper to pre-order it. Okay, and then it's coming out um, April 30th. All right, cool. So, um, and all they have to do to, in order to get that is go to americangunchick.com. Yeah, and then click AGC Store. And then just go to the CDs that are All listed right. right there. And Let then see. Yeah, I think I could throw that up here on the screen. Hold on a second. So if you go to AmericanGunChick.com, there should be like a, a, a page or something like that. It opens. You can go to this or you can go to the store. And then there's uh, Everyone Hates Me. That's the title. That's the title <laughs> of this album, right? Yeah. Okay. With me on the little flamingo with the bunny ears <laughs> and the guns. Right, right. That's the cover. <laughs> there you go. Make sure to check out HankStrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts.